Finance Ministry's economic report for July suggests the worst seems to be over for the coronavirus hit economy. High frequency indicators show an improvement from the unprecedented trough the economy had hit in April 2020. The report has cited indicators including the Index of Industrial Production or IIP, Purchasing Managers Index, Power Generation, Production of Steel and Cement, Railway Freight, Traffic at Major Ports, Air Cargo and Passenger Traffic, as well as E-Way Bill Generation, Consumption of Petroleum Products and Motor Vehicle Registration, among others, to come to this conclusion. India's manufacturing PMI improved from 30.8 in May 2020 to 47.2 in June 2020. Services PMI recovered from 12.6 in May 2020 to 33.7 in June 2020. There was also an uptick in infrastructure and construction activities in the unlock phase. It said, adding that contraction in production of finished domestic steel recovered from 41% in May to 31.1% in June 2020. However, the increase in the COVID cases and subsequent intermittent lockdowns make the recovery prospects fragile and call for constant and dynamic monitoring, the report adds. Now, pinning hopes on the farm sector, the report said, agriculture is set to support the economy in 2020-2021. With the forecast of a normal monsoon at 102% of the long period average, agriculture, which contributes about 15% of the total gross value added, is set to cushion the shock of COVID pandemic on the Indian economy in FY21. Timely and proactive exemptions from COVID-induced lockdowns to the sector facilitated uninterrupted harvesting of the rabi crop and enhanced sowing of the kharif crop as well. Adding a record procurement of wheat has enabled a flow of around 75,000 crore rupees to the farmers, which will boost private consumption in rural areas. Pointing at the recent landmark reforms announced in the agricultural sector, it said the deregulated and liberalized agricultural sector further will empower the farmers to become a bigger and more stable participant in India's growth journey. India is well on the path of recovery from a trough in April, ably supported by proactive government and central bank policies, the macroeconomic report for July released by the Economic Affairs Department said. It also emphasized on the need to bring the infection rate under control. The future economic recovery of India is crucially linked to how the COVID-19 infection curve evolves across states of India.